unordered list and definition list. So ordered list means, as you can see it over here. For example, that is, sorry, this is unordered list, okay? So unordered list means it is also known as your bulleted list. So you can see an effect like this. This is the kind of bullet that you will receive. So which is done with the help of your UL tag and the items are placed with the help of your LI tag. So that is how we'll be doing it. Then the next is your ordered list. Ordered list means it will be in a numbering sequence. Apo ingana numbering sequence and down. This is known as your ordered list. Then we went on to see ordered list with an union and no compulsion that it should always start with number one. You can start from in between series also. You can start from in between series also. So for that what we have is your start attribute. So start attribute which do you can start from in between series also. Is it clear? So the next was your definition list. So definition list means some of the terms define jayan engineer use ya. So I the term kodukka with the help of your dt tag and a define chain of is with the help of your dd tag so both these tags are embedded within your dl tag so that is important so nested list this also we have seen so nested list means one list plays inside another list is known as your nested list so other than our example this we saw in the last class this we saw in the last class how to do your nested list then Links we started to move on. So this links, it is classified into two types that is externally and internally. So internally means it is inside the same document. You can see that effect over there. click then immediately the page below that opens and you can see the contents over there. And you click over that heading itself, the page just shrinks and come back to the normal position. So that is known as your internal linking. Then the next is your external linking. External linking could be done in three different ways. One is your URL and the other is graphical method and the other is email ID method. So we have seen with relative, uh, 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 we have seen with relative URL method and the other is your absolute URL method. Up to this we have seen, is it clear? So for this, I have given you some examples also. For all these, uh, for this relate, up to relative URL, I have given you some examples also. Then the next is your absolute URL. Absolute URL, it is like giving like this. For example, you are giving the exact site address itself. You are giving that exact site address itself sorry a mistake happened graphical link okay sorry here absolute url is giving the exact site address itself this is known as your absolute url is it clear any other the next is your graphical url the next is your graphical url one example i'll show you okay so out or click here and a message we gave in this place. Yes or no? Instead of that is if it dot dot sitilas, I told you I gave a message as click here or back to home page. Like that, I gave a message, right? Instead of giving a message, I can go on to place an image also. Instead of giving a message, I can go on to place a mess uh, image also. That is what is known as graphical hyperlinks. Is it clear? If possible, we'll try to do that, okay. Then the next is email hyper uh, email linking email linking email linking look one more extra added sub attribute is also there extra added sub attribute is also there that is known as your mail to mail to another you should write it together mail to another you should write it together
so the next is creating tables okay this is very important always you will be having one question on this okay always you will be having one question on this or a table tharum how to adinde edile ningal you have to create the table write the tags and create the table and show is it clear so i'll tell you what a table is table means it consists of rows and columns okay table means it consists of rows and columns so simple example what i would like to uh, tell over here is you people are noting down your time tables in your diary and you are putting it in the classroom yes or no so that is known as tables over here so some content which is placed in the form of rows and columns is known as your tables is it clear appo each and every small small boxes inside that uh, inside that is known as your cells that is intersection of rows and columns is known as your cells okay the intersection of rows and columns forms a cell intersection of rows and columns forms a cell that is small small boxes what you see over there okay oro cheriye cheriye boxes aayittu kaanadana cell ennu parayanadu is it clear so based on this you have so many attributes while creating a table based on this you have so many attributes creating the table among that among that your border is very important your border is very important because without a border adu ningal create cheyidathu or table aano ille nalladhu you cannot find out chumma some datas will be scattered or datas ingane you can see it on your browser screen but you don't know whether it is in a form of a table adayathu or proper arrangement unda but you cannot see it as a proper way okay and the again adinu or value kodukumbo it should not be non zero it should sorry it should uh, it should not have zero as value it should not have zero as value right non zero values are compulsory aayittu kodukkandathu that is from 1 to 5 1 to 10 sorry 1 to 10 vera kodukkam okay so the border values can be 1 to 10 border value nu parayanathu a or thickness ne aanu it is told okay so the border value can be up to 1 to 10 okay then the next is your border color apa borders ne you can go on to give a color name a name for the color of uh, for sorry a color could be given for your borders okay so the color how you can set is directly as a color name directly as a color name also you can set or as a hexadecimal code or as a hexadecimal code direct aite adinu oru color name kodukam allengil as hexadecimal code also you can bring out okay then the next is alignment the next is alignment so which side of your browser screen it should be present which side of your browser screen it should be present that is positioning positioning evade aanu vendathu okay that could be left right center that could be left right and center okay idile default idile default is left adayathu ningal oru table create cheyidu align ennalla attribute you didn't give okay if you didn't give the align attribute it also no problem in it okay compulsory aayittu border venam compulsory aayittu border venam okay the remaining attributes are up to your choice okay the remaining attributes are up to your choice okay appo adile if you don't give this what happens is default aite ad left alignment laana create aagwa okay then or table create aagwa for that table alone you can set a background color you can set a background color background color body tag l engena padichu it is bg co l o r okay B G C O L O R. That is our end spelling. Okay, without a gap in between. So B G color could come. Okay. So so again, that is the value. What is it? It could be either a color name directly or a hexadecimal code. It could be a color name directly or a hexadecimal code. Okay. In the other body tag, we learnt about something called as background. Okay. When we were learning body tag. we learn something as background what is that background 
you can set an image okay appa table create cheyumbo adinte background aayittu you can set an image so that could be done with the help of your background attribute that could be done with the help of your background attribute okay next is cell spacing the next is cell spacing for example adu njan kaanichu tharam what it is when we create a table i'll just show you what it is okay cell spacing adai i told you that intersection of rows and columns forms a cell appo oro cell num oru cell thotte inni oru cell vare okay the space between two cells is known as your cell spacing okay the space between two cells is known as your cell spacing okay when we uh, see the example i'll show you all these clearly okay then the next is cell padding then the next is cell padding cell padding means the space between the border and content of the cell the space between border and content of the cell the example i'll show you okay ഇതിന്റെ വാല്യൂസ് ഇത് വന്ന് വാല്യൂസ് വളരെ ചെറിയ വാല്യൂസ് ആണ് അതുകൊണ്ട് വി ഓൾവേസ് ഗിവ് ഇറ്റ് ഇൻ പിക്സൽസ് ഓക്കെ ഇതിന്റെ വാല്യൂസ് വി ഓൾവേസ് വാല്യൂസ് ആർ ഓൾവേസ് വെരി സ്മോൾ അപ്പൊ അതുകൊണ്ട് നമുക്ക് വി ഓൾവേസ് ഗിവ് ഇറ്റ് ഇൻ പിക്സൽസ് നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഇസ് ഹൈറ്റ് ആൻഡ് വെത്ത് ഓക്കെ ടു സെറ്റ് ദ സൈസ് അതായത് ബ്രൗസറിൽ ഹൗ മച്ച് പോർഷൻ എത്ര ബ്രൗസറിന്റെ സൈസ് അനുസരിച്ച് അനുസരിച്ച് ഓക്കെ മൈ മലയാളം ഇസ് നോട്ട് ദുഡ് സോ according to the size of the browser you can set the width and height of the table you can set the width and height of the table so for that you can use percentages for that you can use percentages so these are the various attributes added along with your table tag these are the various attributes added along with your table tag so border is very important the remaining attributes it is all up to your choice to use it is it clear so now we'll see an example for today this part i'll explain in the next class i'll just show you how to create a table and the remaining options i'll explain you in the next class okay so this exam uh, one example i'll show you and then uh, we'll go on to do it okay two more tags are, are there importantly then that i'll explain you when i show you the example itself is it clear so how we are going to create your table is with the help of table tag with the help of table tag you will set the value for border is equal to 5 i will give then i'll tell you some cell spacing also cell spacing is equal to 10 see there is no separation by commas okay oro attributes we are not separating by comma just by a space alone okay just by a space alone cell padding equal to 5 i will give then what is it bg color i will give bg c o l o r is equal to red i will give then what else height and width okay i'll just move around this side table tag okay that is very important bg color is equal to red then height t i g h t height is equal to 50% sorry 50% comma width equal to 60% i'll give i think this is sufficient for us okay i'll uh, show you the example so for what is cell spacing and cell padding when we go on to create okay so this is our table tag okay it's already there by mistake this happened okay so this is our table tag okay then in between this in between this this is a container tag there are two more other important tags there are two more other important tags over here okay one is your th tag one is your th tag 
which is to give the table heading which is to give the table heading okay so here i will give it as okay day okay sorry uh, roll number i'll give i'll give it as roll number okay i'll close uh, sorry three more important tags one more tag i left off here everything is created in the form of rows everything is created in the form of rows so now you are going to start with a new row now you are going to start with a new row that is given with the help of tr tag that is given with the help of your tr tag appo tr tag la rows aanu create aanadhu first we'll give the table head uh, sorry table heading as roll number i'll close the table heading then the next is your name i'll give it as name th name i'll give okay i'll close name sorry close the th tag doctor please write it once when i type over here appo idodu kodi first row kazhinju see you can have as many headings okay you can have as many headings now for a simple example only i have chosen a small question okay a small question only i have chosen so i am just closing the row appo idodu kodi ende headings kazhinju appo headings kazhinja i should close that row okay i am closing that row with the help of close tr okay in it next role i should type the role number and the name appo adina i will open a new row i will open a new row with tr okay appo open a new row kanni ini aduthathu varnadellam data the remaining things that is going to come over here is your data so data is given with the help of td tag data is given with the help of td tag okay so first heading endayirunnu that is role number 1 i'll give like this and then appa our data avada close avanum that is done with the help of close td okay i'll close it then the next roll number 1 corresponding are on roll number 1 who is roll number 1 over here in our class it is abhinav i think so yes okay roll number 1 is abhinav so i'll write as td okay no problem whether it is upper case or lower case okay abhinav a b h i n a v okay i'll close that td appo roll number um kodutha look out the headings roll number nu roll number vannu name nu name has come okay for roll number roll number has come for name name has come appo adodu kodi your row ends appo you have to close that row close that row that is done with tr okay in the next roll number varande so for that what i'll do is open tr open tr okay next what happens is next in the no, roll number 2 kodukanam so that again i'll give it with td that again i'll give it with td what is it roll number 2 i'll give it as close td okay next td okay roll number 2 ara ahmed fahim so ahmed fahim okay then that i will close it okay like this i can go on to include as many number of rows i like this i can go on to include as many number of rows so just a small example i am giving you just only with two headings and two rows only i have done okay ella rows um kazhinju after including all the rows what you have to do is you have to close your table tag you have to close your table tag this is very important okay now after doing all these what am i supposed to do you have to save your file you have to save your file and then i'll come to my browser i'll just refresh it i'll come to the browser and i'll just refresh it what happened bye the color is not very effective earlier what happened was namal font color um red kodutu previous contents were placed in red color so that is why it was not seen now can you see now can you see i didn't give align option alignment nyan koduttilla so what happened was by default it is getting aligned on to the what is it left side of my browser by default it is getting aligned on to the left side of the browser is it clear in idil kore attributes inim add cheyanund that we will see in the next class okay 
important things alone i'll tell you and move on okay so table row is created one minute i'll show you so this is your first row ivade tr start cheyidu okay okay before that i'll tell you a few things self spacing self spacing is there okay yes ivade self spacing unda yes self spacing means the space between the cells this 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 is known as your self spacing okay the space between the cells vertically and horizontally ingane mulla space this also is another space this is known as your cell spacing this is known as your cell spacing okay then the next is cell padding then the next is cell padding okay then the next is cell padding cell padding means the space between the border of the cell and the content the space between the border of the cell and the content you will you may ask a doubt over here for that doubt i'll come over here okay adu nan varam okay the space between the border and the content in the cell is known as your cell padding okay here this this is known as your cell padding appo why not here nu ningalku chodikka okay why not here nu you may ask a question it is because your th tag is always center aligned okay your th tag is always center aligned a center alignment lo polum a spacing um include avum okay even in that center alignment this cell padding space is also included ad include aitana ad center aligned aitu varu okay by default by default the alignment of your table heading is center okay by default the alignment of your table data is left by default the alignment of your table data is left adu kondana ingane vannittullathu the remaining attributes i'll teach you in the next class okay appo namku rows like po so we appo width appo 50% of your browser browser screen the 50% is your sorry height and then 60% is your width appo 60% nu parayanadhu width ithra occupied okay next is your tr tr is your new row opening appo da this is your new row opening okay adile endana ullathu what do you have table uh, heading adile row roll number is there and then name is also there so that name is also here appo idodu kodi your first row is over so what happens nammal row close edu so with that your first row has ended okay next we have opened the second row now now we have opened the second row appa second row ivda start aay there you have your table data as one yes one abhinav is there abhinav's name is there with this your table data end aay idinu thaale ingi vella table data endo illa so with this your table data is ended so adu kondu table row ivda end cheyidu okay so now your row is ended next you have your new row third row varunnadu okay this is your third row apo what is it again table data and two and ahmed fahim is there okay after this you are closing the table row after this you are closing the table row in idodu kodi ini further aayta add cheyyan undengil you have to open a row include the values close the row this process has to be repeated until you come to the last row that you wanted to create okay last row create cheyina vare you have to go on with this process last row kanya endai your table da you have reached towards the end of the table app endai you can give it as close table you can give it as close table app you can give it as close table app close table ay app table um ibada close ay is it clear so this is how you create a table so there are some more attributes to be learned along with your tr th and td tags okay there are some more attributes to be learned along with your tr th and td tags that we will see in the next class okay